Facebook and Microsoft are teaming up to build an underwater cable that will run from northern Virginia to Spain so the companies can transfer data faster between the countries. Dubbed Project Maria, construction begins in August and will take just a little over a year to complete. All right, so Pete, this is really interesting. Google is doing a similar thing. They're building a cable from the U.S. to Japan. Is this something that basically all big companies are going to have to do in the future? I would definitely say yes. Um, for big tech companies, absolutely. I mean, it just speaks to the amount of data these, these, these companies are pushing through, um, uh, they say that uh, two thirds of the world's data on these undersea cables now is, is, is private networks, which means Google, Facebook, uh, Amazon, all these all these guys. And so you look at what's on the cusp, like VR, streaming entire experiences in a sort of spherical video kind of way, and doing things within that in real time. I mean, that that kind of data needs a tremendous throughput. I mean, I think this is the first of many cables that they're going to be laying in various oceans. So you just kind of answered the question a little bit um, that I was going to ask, but what kind of data will they be transferring here? Yeah, I mean, VR, I mean, it remains to be seen whether VR is the next big thing. Some mm -hmm. people are saying it's the next 3D TV, which mm -hmm. is not good news, but a lot of people and a lot of money are banking on it being a success. And if you've experienced VR, you will believe that hype because it, uh, if you experience good VR, it's great. So VR or to some extent 360 video, so the 360 degree videos, um, that's sort of a, pretty much the exact same thing. There's the, uh, the scenario of say, uh, selling tickets, courtside tickets to a basketball game just by putting a, a very good 360 camera yeah. there and everyone can get courtside tickets all of a sudden. Uh, that's a very lucrative prospect. Um, so that's, that's a big thing. Um, and then there's just the tremendous sort of computing uh, engines that, that need to uh, be applied to our everyday tasks. Um, you know, maps, Google Street View, all these things, and, and more and more of that, our apps are demanding to sort of talk to the cloud and do this stuff all the time. Yeah, that 360 technology is something they did next door at uh, CBS this morning. It was very cool. They had the camera up at, during a broadcast and people could actually see what was going on yeah, in the studio. Yeah, and you put on the headset and you're just looking around. <laughs> it's fascinating, and it's, yeah. fascinating.